my gosh, it's that time again. Who do? Welcome, everybody. It's that special time of the week where we all get together and we talk about art, weed, and video games. It's 8-Hit Gaming! And guess what? Our guest this week is a new friend of mine, a dear friend of mine, a very talented artist and musician. Give it up at home for our special guest, Machete! Oh my god. We don't have a last name, huh? It's kind of like Madonna no, and Cher. Yeah, <laughs> it's like I, I'm exactly like Madonna and Cher. <laughs> yes, in every single way. Um, thank you so you much for You know what single us. name artist I'm actually probably the most like? Please tell me. Never mind, I just thought of like four. Well, give me the top three. I was going to say <laughs> Dev, but then I was like, wait, Kesha. Then I was like, wait, Fergie. And then I was like, wait, Peaches. So I like... You are kind of like I like peaches. single name artists. I see Peaches. In yeah, you. everyone sees Peaches in me. I met Peaches when she uh, played at the Neptune in October. Oh, wow. That recently? Yeah, super recent. Oh, what? Well, um, oh. No uh, pressure? Yeah. You might not see me smoke on camera because I ate two edibles before I came here. And they take very good care of their voice because they're a very talented vocal performer. You're kind of a rapper hip hop. I'm, yeah, I'm a, I'm a rapper, singer, and producer. I'm an underground pop star. <laughs> yes. Is absolutely. what I like to say. Your hip hop you. is very funny and uh, it has a lot of pop culture references you yeah. like reference teen witch in one of your rhymes yeah you do, <laughs> do a little so pop bat in there oh uh, yeah i reference like Yu Gi Oh and like fucking <laughs> like sonic the hedgehog and do you have any recent references that you've written that you were like really proud of this actually ties in perfectly i said i'm a rude ass bitch rap game pete burns <laughs> um and pete burns was the lead singer of dead or alive um and he died last year in october and he's like a major Bummer. influence idol of mine um, and my next single is a cover of You Spin Me Around by Dare Alive. Oh, love it. Everybody go check out Machete's SoundCloud. You got something to listen to when you're going to the store, when you're going to the laundromat, when you're getting down at the club. I definitely make what can definitively be called laundry <laughs> music. So real quick before we start playing the games, yeah. let's talk about your tattoos. They must be addressed okay. because they're awesome. I have a lot of gaming tattoos. Stuff, That's so. Jigglypuff. Yeah, Pat, I have Jigglypuff. Past guest on the show, gig- Jigglypuff. <laughs> past guest on the show? We just played Pokemon Snap. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You guys have also played. She's my Smash Bros main, but not. it's only in Melee because they really they nerfed, nerfed her. her. Yeah, I got Birdo um, because she's a transsexual like myself. Love it. Um, good old K- Kate Sith. It's actually pronounced Ketchy from Wait, Final Fantasy. Oh, from Final Fantasy. Yeah. yeah. Which, um, which iteration of the franchise? This is his Final Fantasy Eleven design when they made him a twink. And it's like <laughs> my favorite one. Like, <laughs> my Pikmin one. tattoo. Love it. Yeah, I get so many it's compliments all of them, huh? on it. Oh, yeah, it's all every single type of Pikmin. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah the white cute. one. Yeah, the poison white one. That's me. And I got Kermit suffering. <laughs> it says suffer. Okay, so... We were kind of last minute faced with a conundrum, but we're we're real can do people here at Eight Hit Gaming, um, because we were gonna play Sonic Adventure Two today. But Sonic Adventure Two battle. <laughs> Say something, you fake hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> um, but unfortunately, there was a whole bug with my PS3. I couldn't get the game capture off of it. We'll play the game in the future. But we were going through the games I did have, and then I was like, "Well, I have this game called Arms on Switch," and I was like, "Bitch." Bitch, <laughs> I want to play ARMS. I've been so hyped for this game since the like as the first trailer. Okay, let's talk about which of these characters are queer. Um, I so, mean, I mean, he's already. <laughs> what, um, so, Springman to me, he looks like, he's like mainly straight. I but think he's straight, but he gets He lets guys suck his dick. Yeah. Yeah. He like, goes to 24 to get this like lean bot. Wait, and in like, the steam room, he's like... Hey, whatever happens in there. Yeah, he's... My he's, girlfriend he's, doesn't need to know about it. Oh, yeah, he has a girlfriend, for sure. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, Ribbon Girl, sh- she's kind of a dyke. Did you see it? Yeah, yeah! Like, I don't... Like, a super high femme, but, like, she just looks like she's mm. too good for men. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Um, oh. I'm gonna say he's openly bisexual. He's... Yeah, he's... <laughs> He's got to be into dudes. Like, yeah, look just at for my sake. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's definitely hot. Like, he's the cutest, right? He's the hot, he's definitely the sexiest character in, in this game. Okay. Um, Master Mummy is also. Well, wait, the take hot, that yeah. back because we got Master Mummy. Here Mom comes here. trade. What? <laughs> <laughs> if someone walked into the cuff wearing this, I think he would walk out. <laughs> every phone number, every phone number, girl. Min Min is a cute. Ramen. <laughs> She's a she, ramen boxer. I feel like she might be one of those um, non-binary teens. Oh yeah, like Jaden Smith. 
Yeah, yeah. Min Min and Jaden Smith. It's she gonna seems, happen. Yeah, they're like, gonna be a cool non-binary couple. She seems like she doesn't want to be defined by gender. She just kind of has like a tomboyish quality to her. Cute. Quintel is trans. Oh, I buy it. Yeah, those shoulders, girl, clocked. Um, but <laughs> she looks damn good. She's gorgeous. Her, She's kind of my favorite character. Bite and bark. Okay, well, robots. Let's, I was gonna say they're obviously a gay couple. <laughs> it's like a C3PO R2D2 kind of relationship. Yeah. I forgot there was like a dual character in this game. I always forget them. I love dual ass characters. Ice, ice timers. timers. Ice climbers. Fuck yeah. I, yeah. I used to get down with ice climbers. That was my main. For Nana a while. is my bitch. Okay. Um, I actually Kid don't Cobra. even remember this character. Kid Cobra. Is he um, made of snakes? He's made of snakes. I don't like that at all. I actually am also kind of uncomfortable with it right now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to move on. I don't want to see straight. that character anymore. I'm gonna say he's a straight guy. I'm oh, repelled by him, so maybe I, you're I right. t- Helix is the sexiest one. I forgot about him. <laughs> and I think this is gonna be the one time we fight against each other because I don't okay. want us to to get we're a team. We're we're buddies. We're yeah. a team. Oh damn! Yes, get punched, ho. So we're playing with most controls. It's a little easier to control with uh two two thumbsticks, but I think this is more fun. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try this fucking shot I don't know if it's better or worse. Oh, cool. Uh, it loops around. Ooh, there's a fucking bomb soccer ball. Like, yeah, they kind of just the like field. throw little curveballs at you sometimes. Yeah, so. the arenas in this shit are so fun. I love fighting games. I love Tekken so much. Ooh, who's your character in Tekken? Oh, I play so many. I think Nina's like my main bitch. Um, I love Zhao Yu. I love Lili, uh, Panda, Raven, <laughs> eh, Christy, fucking. Uh, <laughs> it just sounds like you're Miguel. shouting out. It just uh, sounds like you're shouting out your entourage right now. I know. Hey, big thanks to Panda. Big thanks to Miguel. Nina, yeah, you know you're my number one Kuna girl. Kunamitsu <laughs> is that girl. I should get a Kunamitsu tattoo. That'd be really good. Add it to the collection. Uh, she's <laughs> trans, just like me. Duh. Um, <laughs> Are those the only two trans video game characters you can think of? Is Birdo? Oh, Kunamitsu's, Kunamitsu's not Kunamitsu. actually trans. Oh. I just call every character trans. Um, well, good. Like, <laughs> what, actually, Bayonetta there should be trans. more. I think she probably. Bayonetta is, is trans. If you know she behaves, that's <laughs> one of the girls right there. <laughs> Rouge the Bat, trans. <laughs> that body, no way is it Sonic Adventure, calling back, Rouge the Bat may in fact be a trans woman. She literally looks like a fucking femme queen. Like, she'd be snatching trophies in the ballroom scene <laughs> with that body. Are you kidding? That's both of us versus some weirdos. Okay. And, like, when we're tied We to- know they're weirdos. <laughs> they have to be. Okay. One of them's the Snake Man. <laughs> Blorb, Ice Dragon, and Guardian. <laughs> we were gonna stick Their names are Blorb? With good old Blorb. Yeah, that's the name of my Oh, punches. let's throw your Blorbs at him. Let's go, Blorb. Hey, Blorb! Oh, these ones hey, bounce? Hey, Blorb. Oh, yes. Get thrown, bitch. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I don't know if I like these bouncing-ass Blorbs. They're kind of hard <laughs> to deal with. Uh, so you're anti-Blorb? We can yeah. go on record. I bow down to Blorb. <laughs> <Try. laughs> you turned it into a verb. I love uh, it. Yeah, I'm gonna Blorb all over that house. Machete, take, take why did you home. leave me alone with these people? They're maniacs. I, <laughs> I'm so close to beating this fucking dude and he won't go down. It's making me so mad. How is he blocking me? When he grabs you, ah, 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 I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Maybe if I just block him, I'll win. You gotta hit him. You gotta get him down. Oh, oh, fuck me. One second left. <laughs> one second left? I, I, have, I have the worst luck with games sometimes. Do you ever feel like you're just, like, getting the raw end of the deal every match you log into? Um, I feel like I'm getting the raw end of the deal every time I play video games with my friend Campbell, because he's really good at them. Is he one of those people that's good at them because he plays a lot of them? No, he's just... Lucky? Yeah, he's just, like, blessed. That makes me so mad when it's, like, a game I've, like, played for hours and hours and hours, and my yeah. friend just picks it up and is like, oh, beat you. Yeah, he would always demolish me. Whoa, who the fuck is that guy? Headlock. What? Is that a, like, secret character? Oh, I think maybe it's a boss that we're all Oh, it's a boss! At. That's pretty dope. Okay, wow, this movie's this got the weirdest shit. Please don't hurt me. Oh, damn, I threw him. Oh, yeah, get thrown, bossy. <laughs> <laughs> I was also excited to visit the Chow Garden with you. Oh, yeah, tell me about how Sonic Adventure 2 came into your life. I got a Dreamcast for Christmas when I was, like, I think 10. Um, because I have- How old are you? 
I'm 24. I'm turning oh. 25 in like two quarters. I hate when people are younger than me, but please continue. But yeah, um, so I got a Dreamcast. And I, I played got, that game when I was like 15. Yeah, I got you're all... like, oh, I was nine. <laughs> <laughs> I could have babysat you. <laughs> yeah, I was the youngin. And um, yeah, I don't know. I just, it's like just definitely one of the my favorite games of all time and one of the games that had like the biggest impact on me. I just really like the awesome story soundtrack. The oh, the sound the the Knuckles levels have the best songs in that game. Death Chamber. Yeah. Death Chamber. You know me, the fighting freak Knuckles. <laughs> oh yeah, there's like a lot of rap breakdowns. <laughs> yeah. He's like rapping about how he needs to find the Master Emerald. <laughs> right. I like a lot of rap breakdowns in my Sonic games. Oh, you yeah. survived. Yeah. Okay, good. That's good. She did that. One of us won. <laughs> You didn't beat the boss, but you survived. Winner. Hey. That's a scary boss. I don't like that. Oh, we're playing volleyball. Volleyball. It's I'm just excited. called V-Ball. They, they didn't get the rights to volleyball. Yeah. So they it's, have... co it's copywritten. <laughs> what were some of your favorite moments in Sonic Adventure 2? Um, <laughs> oh, there's so many. There's this scene um, when they're all up on the Space Colony arc. Mm -hmm. uh, at, toward the end. Towards the end. <laughs> yeah. Where um, it's at, when uh, after Knuckles and Rouge have their boss fight against each other. Oh, we won because they disconnected. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> Continue. <laughs> but yeah, there's there's this one scene where they're like fighting, and then they like it's like a boss fight, you know, on the in that on the arc, and um, then there's this cut scene afterwards where they're like both like panting really heavy, and then they get an argument about the emerald, and then Rouge just gives her back, and then she like falls at one point, and Knuckles like saves her life, and there's this like really sexual element to their relationship. Oh, Knuckles and Rouge. Yeah, for sure. And I thought it was like. So so hot when I was young. Like I like would watch that cutscene a lot. I'd go into story mode and like just play that pretty level just to see that cutscene and just be like, ah, oh, this is sexy. Oh, you're on the Beyblade level. I had it on GameCube, yeah. so I, I must have played the port of it. Yeah, because I know it was Dreamcast. Battle, yeah. yeah, yeah. The Chow Garden had like limitless fun. Yeah, it was like you a whole play for so many Tamagotchi, hours. but you could like cross breed them. Um, what are some other like super fun GameCube games you remember? Mario Kart Double Dash. Very good entry Obviously, the Smash Bros. Melee. That's, do you think that's the best one? Most people. I would say that. that and four are my favorites. Four is really good. Yeah. You know my song, Recognize This Pussy? I do don't recognize this pussy. Could you sing maybe just the chorus for the people at home? Stupid motherfucker better recognize this pussy. You're a broke motherfucker better recognize this pussy. You're a lame motherfucker better recognize this pussy. Recognize this pussy. Recognize this pussy. Oh, look, she's. It's you know. along with it. <laughs> Did you yeah, see? Yeah, I saw. She was getting her life. That was fun. That instrumental samples Birdo in Mario Kart Double Dash. Like, oh, really? Yeah, there's like Birdo's voice clips like all throughout that beat. That's right. I don't think anyone ever notices that or picks up on it, but it's like a really cool, funny detail to me. Are there any other examples of you like incorporating chip tunes or like video game music into your into your songs? Some of the drums I use on my song, uh, Fuckboy. God, I hate <laughs> that I have a song titled that. No, you uh, have to. We live in a world with fuckboys. We need to have a song called Fuckboy. <laughs> okay, well, thank necessary. you. But anyway, on my song, Fuckboy, <laughs> from my first EP, Cool Tricks, uh, like the the two the drums are like NES samples. It's oh, cool. like really like glitchy, like stompy, like crunch of like a kick and snare. I think that beat is so dope. It's literally nothing but a kick and a snare, but it's like such a good beat. Rad. Like <laughs> I'm like really proud of it. Oh, I love it. Forever. Crossing. But who's your favorite? Who are some of your like your your best friends you made in Animal Crossing? Like as far as villagers. Oh my god. So I remember playing Animal Crossing on GameCube. Yeah. And I was probably like three months in. And there was this little cat named Punchy who lived Punchy. like right next door to me. Yeah. And every day I would log in and Punchy would be there waiting for me and like she would like leave me letters and stuff. And one day I logged on. And, and she moved? She fucking moved. Oh. She didn't tell me. She didn't give me a heads up. She just left a letter that was like, hey, I'm leaving. That I'm leaving this sucks. little town. I'm going somewhere new. She didn't tell me where. I can't go <laughs> visit her. I can't send her a letter to say, hey, I miss you, girl. The town's not the same without you. I don't. I think I put the game down for a solid month after that. I was so depressed. That's so funny. <laughs> it's so funny how you like genuinely form like friendships with them. There's a sheep named Curlos. Uh, Curlos? Yeah. Because he, he has little curls? Yeah, he's a new leaf and he's Curlos and he's definitely gay and he's definitely a stoner. I love it. Like, he's this fucking I love the little... ones that clearly smoke pot. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, Antonio, the anteater, trade. 
he yeah. always he like, wears a tank top and he works out. Yeah, he I always talk about working out, and I'd be like, oh, I'm gonna. I remember I'm, I'm Antonio gonna, well. You need to give me that snooter suck with that little nose of yours. Uh, <laughs> what if you? Like, I, want, I was trying to fuck Antonio. Oh, Antonio, sure. there's. I think there's some ants in my apartment. Could you come over and yeah. help me out? <laughs> uh, Baby Shetty, guess what? What? It's time for the quick time event. Oh yeah. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> Question one, which of the following is not a real WWF game? A, WWF Attitude, B, WWF Legacy, C, WWF No Mercy. Uh, I'm gonna say B, Legacy. That is correct. Awesome. Uh, question two, what is the name of the cool dog guitarist in Animal Crossing? A, Tom Nook, B, Mr. Rossetti, C, K.K. Slider. Motherfucking K.K. Slider. King of all Animal Crossing villages. Love it. Question three. Which of these games does not let you play as Catwoman? A. Lego Batman. B. Injustice 2. C. Batman Arkham Origins. I'm gonna say Injustice 2. I'm sorry. It's, it's Arkham Lego Origins. Batman. It's Arkham Origins. It's Arkham Origins. <laughs> Weirdly, you can't. That's, Question that's four. That's very weird. Question four. Up, up, down, down. Left, right, left, right. B.A. is a... Famous cheat code known as what? A, the Capcom code. B, the Konami code. C, the Square Enix code. That's B, the Konami code. Very correct. Question five. Kevin Spacey did mocap and voice acting for this major game sequel. A, Darksiders 2. B, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. C, Sc StarCraft 2. That's gonna be B, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Awesome, awesome. Question six. Stardew Valley is a farming sim that takes place in which fictional town? A. Pelican Town. B. Smallville. C. Portland, Oregon. <laughs> it's A. Pelican Town. <laughs> That's correct. <laughs> Question seven. The Game Boy Pocket used which kind of batteries? A. Double A. B. Triple A. C. D. It's gonna be uh, double A. I'm sorry, it was triple A. Game Weird. Boy Pocket. Yeah. Oh, Game Boy Pocket. I did say Pocket. I probably should have emphasized it. Oh no, I knew you said Pocket. I just um. <laughs> question eight. <that> one. <laughs> and the final question: Which is not a song from the Sonic Adventure 2 soundtrack? A. Escape from the City. B. Simple and Clean. C. Deeper parentheses Death Chamber. <laughs> Simple and Clean? Are you kidding me? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is simple and clean? Is of course, answer? simple and clean is my there answer. There we go. <laughs> Sonic Yay! Adventure 2 soundtrack is so good. I know. If Honestly, if you put that shit on in a club, I would it go, would be packed. I would go absolutely uh, buck wild to fucking um, Pumpkin Hill at the club. Let's do your plugs, baby. My plugs? Yeah, your plugs. What am I plugging? You're um, plugging your music, you're plugging your shows, you're plugging uh, the whole machete experience. Yeah. <laughs> My single, You Spin Me Round, is coming out, and it'll probably be out by the time this video is here. So go check that shit out. Um, and Cool Tricks 3 is going to be later this year. Machete, thank you so much for being on the show. Everybody at home, please go to Machete SoundCloud. They have really amazing music. I think you will enjoy it. Uh, there's lots of video game references as we were discussing. So if you're a video game person, this is right up your alley. Um, Machete, thank you so much for being on the show. Thank you for having me. And all my shit's also on iTunes and Spotify and all of that. iTunes, Just search my name. Spotify. And it's Machete with an I. M-I-C-H-E-T. Not like Danny Trejo. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little different. <laughs> like Michelle with a T instead of an L. Yeah. But not two T's. Not two T's. Just it's one not Michelle T. with two L's. It's not Michette. We're not friends with her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> too many L's. Oh, my God. I can't play this anymore. That's okay. That's okay. Machete, say bye to all the people. All right. Bye. Later. Bye, people. Everybody. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs>